A ratio! What's a ratio? A ratio is the quotient of two numbers. We need to get those numbers in the same units. We have 20 yards to 8 feet. We need to convert one. Which one? Well, I probably want to convert these guys. Why? Because I can take that yards and put it into feet and have whole numbers. I'm looking at that 8. Great. I'm like, how do I convert that into yards? I have to divide it by 3. And then I'm like, uh-oh, fraction action. Everybody's scared of fractions. So, we need to get them in the same units. What else? It's yards 2 feet. That means this one needs to go on top. This to that. The that is on the bottom. So it's yards to feet. So we need to convert those yards. Yard. So then, what do I have? One yard is to 12 feet. No, that's inches. Three feet. Yes, I'm just about done with you. Okay, sure. So then, the one I'm converting to needs to go on top. So what am I going to do? I'm going to go through and I'm going to divide by one yard. One yard. Um, I don't know where the R came from. Mm, why? So then what do I have? I have one is equal to three over one. This is feet to yard. That works. Okay, so if I'm going two feet, then I'm going to take that one yard. I'm going to take that 20, and I'm going to multiply it by three. Because the one you're going to, I guess you could see 20 yards times three feet per yard. The yards are going to go, although it doesn't really happen like that. In this unit analysis, we'll be left with feet. So then, this is going to be 60 feet. Great. So 20 yards is 60 feet. And now it's our feet to make a ratio of these two guys. All right. So 20 yards is 60 feet to 8 feet. Hopefully this doesn't lead to D feet. Oh my God, make him stop. This to that. That means that is on bottom. So if I'm looking for my ratio, which is the quotient of two numbers, my units are going to be gone. So this is 60. I guess you could put the feet over there and you could cross out the feet like you did over there. Some people don't like feet. Anyway, and then this is all over. Eight. Great. So this ratio does need to be reduced. I deduce. I could reduce by a deuce, but can I go bigger? Can I go four? Can I go eight? Let's try 4, sure. So 4 goes into 60 15 times. How many times does 4 go into 8? 2, can I reduce any further? No. I found my ratio. Box and flower.